the first half of my day today was spent walking around Salvation Army and Target and Goodwill. And sometimes when I do things like that, and I'm fully intending not to buy anything unless there is like something that is just the greatest deal in the world, which there never is. There never is. But sometimes when I do that, I just walk the aisles and think about the number of people who specifically go to thrift stores and always come away with something. And it could be that they genuinely find a use for all of those things, or that they have a wider variety of movies that they're willing to spend money on at a thrift store, or at Target, where people can go and grab a bunch of stuff just because the lighting in there is better than in Walmart, which I learned from my brother. It's crazy when you think about it, how being a consumer and finding the best deals makes you a totally different breed of person than being a consumer and buying just because you can. And I don't think I surround myself by people who buy just because they can, because, um, let's be honest, the type of job that I'm working doesn't allow me to do that, so probably no one I'm working with will. And no one I'm friends with is old enough to have that much money. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> and then I think about how I probably won't ever be the person that can buy whatever I want just because I can. And... There's something kind of freeing about that, if we're being honest. I don't mind the idea of going to a thrift store because things are cheaper and have been used before. And that by not purchasing things brand new, that you're technically not supporting waste. And that's good. Obviously there are better ways to contribute to not wasting things, like not purchasing plastic items ever, or recycling everything, composting everything, those types of things. They're great, they're great practices, but ultimately because we live in a society that is controlled by consumerism, Thinking about thrift stores versus going to a place like Target, it's just interesting. And I don't really know if there's a greater point behind all of that or whether it's just me thinking about it. I mean, I am just thinking about it at this time. But I walked out of all three of those stores with nothing today. Thought real hard at Goodwill about buying the first season of The Americans on DVD because it was in great condition. And then I remembered that it's on Amazon Prime and that I've already seen that season and it's those types of things that prevent me from having a massive movie collection at this point in my life even though I'm obsessed with movies and TV shows. Just one of those things. 